It's uh, been a very busy day at the ballpark. Early voting for Decision 2020 is certainly in full swing. Tulsa County voters wrapped around the block at One Oak Field waiting to cast their ballots. Our Mason Morrow is live at the ballpark tonight. And Mason, you've been there all day. What have you seen? Yeah, that's right, Mike and Karen. Actually, right now, even though the sun is out, this is about the shortest I've seen the line all day. As you can see, I'd say about 100 yards behind me is the uh, front gate there, the open entrance to One Oak Field. And this is the end of the line. But earlier today, this morning and uh, early afternoon, even in the rain, cold and drizzle. The line was wrapped all the way around here down on Elgin towards Archer and almost nearly all the way to Greenwood Avenue. And voters I spoke to in person said that they waited about two, two and a half, sometimes even three hours uh, before they were able to get to the ballot booths and uh, cast their votes. Uh, voters are asked to fill out a green ballot request form, walk to the concession stand where they'll show identification and stand where they'll show or uh, stand where they'll get a ballot from a poll worker. They fill out their ballot in a voting booth and then feed it into the ballot counting machines. The choice to have early voting here at One Oak Field was mostly due to COVID concerns. A voter I spoke with told me she felt a lot safer here than in Bixby where there's no mask mandate. We like the idea of an outdoor, you know, venue versus our local option is um, an indoor school, an elementary school, which we were not as excited about. There are also quite a few hand sanitizer stations and social distancing queues uh, that act as stickers on the concourse. Poll workers are wearing masks and election officials tell me that most voters in line are also wearing masks. And another uh, restriction that they're taking here today is only allowing voters to use one single pen when they go to the ballot booth. That means every pen that they use afterwards, it's tossed away. And I'm sure you can imagine they're going through quite a few pens here today as we've seen so many people show up here to vote on the first day of early voting at six o'clock. Uh, hear from one uh, person who came here to One Oak Field to vote for the first time since he became a U.S. citizen. And he tells me it's obviously a day that he'll never forget. Live in Tulsa, Mason Morrow, two works for you.